Hi everyone, welcome to this Icon Investment video, focusing on the icons that are currently the cheapest within the game. Also, there's some smart investments we had with like um, squad battle rewards and um, weekend league rewards, for example. So we can smash links, we also sub to the channel if you're new, follow me on Twitter at G is a legend. All the links are down below for playlists in the channel and social media links, as always. So I just did this video just to give you an idea on what icon prices are just now, but also just kind of explain... Um, like which cards to kind of keep your eyes peeled for like in terms of snipes now a lot of these icons the cheapest is roughly the cheapest i've seen is 445k now usually a lot of these are between four just now between 450 and 470k um you will find the odd one does pop up for um snipes like um for example I've seen Owen, I've seen Rui Costa, I've seen Akuyo, I've seen Nesta, I've seen Litmanen, Petit, and Loudrop. Um, it's just some examples. Um, for the Loudrop in question, it was the eight, the lowest rated one, not his left wing version. And same for Overmars. I've seen a lot of them. They pop up, and you're like, oh, I'll quickly go and try and get them. Um, I've found most of the time, I'm not being... I'm being, I'm holding off actually um, buying them because, um, like for example, I missed out on a Kocha the other day for 408k and I was like, could I really sell them? And that was kind of, it was in my mind, I thought, could I really sell them for say 440, 450 and actually make profit? But pretty much most of these players you will find like um, Crespo and Zaggy, Perez, a lot of them, put, uh, the thing is, there's very few on the market these days. The most I generally see of the lower rated icons, um, like the baby versions or even the second versions, because you've got to remember, is, like, for example, a Kocha, he has a, um, a right mid version that's 85 and 87, and they both frequently show up as, like, relatively cheap. Like, Rykard, for example, um, I missed one the other day that was about it worked out about 15% less, so like, and I was like, I just let them pass, I'm, but I'm doing this a lot just now, I'm letting some of them pass, because the prices seem to, they hit a peak of like say 470, and then the low point they'll hit is around 440, 445, and it seems to be constant fluctuation, I honestly do not know what's going on, Bearcamp I didn't expect to be so cheap at times, but it, it kind of just is. Yashin, same applies with him, 89 and 91 versions are like frequently up there for cheap, but it's it's trying to get them is the hardest part really, like Loud Drops 89, I don't, half the time I'm surprised to um, see him, Larson the other night, for example, there was about 5 versions put up of him, and the cheapest went from about f um, 4 um, 55 to like 4 35, and it was like nobody, it was like nobody was really buying them, but then they finally did. But either way, guys, if you've made any snipes at all, these if I've had success, like Hadji, for example, earlier in the year, I got him for pretty much min price and sold on for about 300 300k plus profit. But hopefully, you find this useful. Let me know in the comments, as I said, if you've made any snipes, any investments with icons whatsoever. Smash for likes as always. Sub to the channel for new. Follow me on Twitter, Jesus Legend, and I will catch you all later.